Hi, I'm Scott Epp with Abundance Coaching. And today, I have Sean Salem with us. And Sean's gonna just uh, tell us a bit of a testimony about why he came to coaching and what his experience has been about uh, with coaching. And just share a little bit more about what the benefits in his experience have been uh, with coaching. So Sean, why did you come to coaching in the first place? I sort of reached that sort of peak in my career and had two successful businesses and needed to uh, sort of sit down and go through why uh, why things are successful and where things needed to improve. And uh, I found that uh, life coaching was a great fit. And Scott was able to give me the tools and resources that I didn't have to take it to that next level. Awesome, awesome, cool. So could you describe just maybe just in a nutshell um, what type of I guess feelings or what kind of state you were that actually drove you to the idea of hiring a coach? Well, I just thought it was kind of in a stall pattern and, uh, and in a sort of needed a sort of move forward. With the resources I had, and the, it was going very well, but I needed to go to the next level and grow it. And I found that I was my own, I was my own limitation. Uh, it wasn't from lack of opportunity or anything. It was from lack of sort of like a like a pro athlete that still has a coach to even improve his game even more. Yeah, awesome. And we've talked about just so many things in our sessions, but uh, a few of the things, uh, even you know, around uh, business decisions uh, that you that you felt were really key. Uh, is there anything that you'd like to comment on, on you know, maybe some of that aspect of, of the coaching? Well, I found with life, with life coaching the the, the, the the very fact to have a sounding board off of someone who not only uh, has the business resources that, to help you in different situations, but also just a, another credible uh, person to you know, help you along and give you that sort of resource to make the proper decisions and, a, and another opinion that you may or not have had yourself. Mm-hmm. And just have someone, and, and to have someone who's actually trained for the position rather than just someone who who has uh, got an opinion, but rather than an educated opinion. Someone who's in business already too. It's, Scott, you already do a lot of things that I already do as well. So you... It's not just a, your opinion or, or whatever. You have an educated opinion and you have resources that, that will apply to different situations I've faced. That's awesome, yeah. Sean, there was, there, was a, there was an awesome, awesome session that we had shortly after an experience you had in Chicago this year. And a lot of things uh, that happened along the way kind of led you to that experience. Uh, I know coaching was just a small part of that. But you gave some things some credit as to, you know, just how you felt and, you know, in your words, to copy you, that was the best summer ever. Sure. Yeah. yeah it was. Um, could you maybe just uh, uh, share with us just a, a little bit more about your feelings or how you arrived at that, that statement? Well, it, as in life, you mature and you grow and you come to different positions and places and being someone who wants to progress and, and keep growing and going. The uh, life coaching was definitely, it gave me questions I didn't, I didn't know I already had. And it helped me answer things that I didn't know were hindrances. And, you know, through the life coaching, I brought ideas and things to, to the surface that, that I hadn't thought of. And then when going to Chicago and having my mind opened and, and uh, the possibilities and stuff like that, I was in a much better place to have that to be very beneficial. And life coaching isn't uh, making a life, it's coaching a life. That's right. You know, and there's a, there's a partnership with that, and that's why I found life coaching to be very beneficial. Awesome. Awesome. Couldn't have said it better. <laughs> so, uh, just the, the last question How do you feel coaching could benefit? someone else.
knowing now what you know just from your own experience. And I guess if you could also reframe what coaching might be from a client's perspective. Well, I, coming into life coaching, I, I looked at it as just another self-help thing. I didn't understand really what life coaching was. It's, it's not another rehab self-help thing at all. What it really is, it's coaching. It's taking something that's already going great in some areas and maybe not so great in other areas and making greatness out of it all. What I would say to someone else if they were looking into life coaching is that it's, it's important to participate in it. It's not, it's not a, it's not a thing that just takes over and tells you how to live. It's, it truly is something that takes your life, gives you the resources to take it to the next place that you just can't do alone, and gives you ideas and creative uh, thoughts and questions and challenges and, and uh, that you just, you just wouldn't get on your own. Awesome. That's what I find it. I got the most out of it. That's great. Well, thank you for listening. We hope you got something out of that. And thank you, Sean.